welcome to another episode of Pokemon Go. In today's episode, as uh, you're going to figure out very soon, we're hunting Entei's today. Hopefully, we can get our first one. We are 0 for 6 at the moment. And uh, let's see, we're going in with 9 balls for the first Entei of today. Hopefully, we will catch Entei today. This is Meisner Place, which is our number one gold gem. We have three gold gems now, which is very cool. And uh, we're also going to be needing to get more golden raspberries and other such items. 1874 Entei, so not a great one by any means, but we'll try it. Not even a nice throw or anything like that, but one, two, nope. Alright, that would have been insane. First ball. It's all about the camera. All right, second ball. There we go, nice throw. Hopefully we can catch it. One, two. All right, still got seven more chances. Hopefully we uh, catch it. Just put it in the Pokedex and then after that we'll just look for better ones. Okay. Yeah, just relax, be patient. Okay, great throw. Great throw. One. Go. Alright. Starting to get into that crunch area. Five five balls left. Five balls left. We got the fountain right next to us. Getting the phone wet. Not a good thing. Four balls left. There we go. Great throw. Did you catch it? No. No. One, two. Oh. Alright. Three balls left. Three balls left. Alright. It looks like most people are still trying to catch it or have not caught it. Another great throw is what we need, our greats. One, two, no. Yeah, that'd be great. All right, two balls left. Just confirmed we got a ride to the next one, which is great. No need to skate. All right, and two balls left. Oh, no. Second too early. One ball left. Oh no, that's hitting me with some lag. Okay, patience is key. Just gotta wait for it to attack. Stop jumping. Oh my god, what was that? Alright, next Ente. 0 for 7. Alright, so we are at Ente number 2 of the day. Hopefully we can catch this one. 0 for 7 so far. And another fast TM. We need some charged TMs. Alright, let's see. Six, no damage, because I was out of the lobby for most of the time. Nine balls. Nine is my favorite number, so... 1907. Oh, please don't run away from me. Oh, no. 1907. 1930 is perfect. Ooh, that's a great throw. Okay. Let's go. No lag. One. Oh, no. Okay. Eight balls left. Eight balls left. Come on. Okay. Great throw. Great throw. I thought I missed it. One, two, Duh! Okay, seven balls left. Seven balls left. Let's go. What? Okay, a little more patient. Six balls left. 
Come on, do something. Do something. Oh my gosh, what is that? Alright, that's a problem that needs to be fixed. Yeah, no, that's not good. Four balls left. Come on. Excellent throw. No, not even a shake. Three balls left. This is no bueno. Alright. Come on. There we go. Nice throw. That's that's a bug that needs to be fixed where the curveball doesn't curve. One, two, oh my goodness. Alright. Two balls left. This one's gonna hurt. Okay. Two balls left. We can do this. We can do this. We can do this. Okay, great throw. Right on the face. Okay. One. Two. Oh, okay. Alright. Last ball left. Last ball. Last ball. Come on. Curve for me. There we go. Not even... Not even nice, but one and it's Alright, no mute. No no entes. No entes today. That one hurt. That was 1907. Oh what is that? Is that gonna be a level Ooh, there's a Cinequil around here. That's kinda cool. And that's gonna be a level two raid. Oh man, that hurt. That hurt so So we have done two Ente raids for the day and so far we haven't done anything uh else. We're buying some raid passes because we're out at this point, but uh, yeah, not much luck going on today, unfortunately. Uh, it is early still. Hopefully there'll be some more later on. Uh, I'll do some exploring around Wellington. Maybe we'll get something good. Uh, yeah, other than that, there is a green market. I might check that out real quick. Maybe get some cinematics of it. Yeah. What was it? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I think it was 1897. There we go. There we go. Okay, let's go. All right. See you guys there. Let's go. Yeah, don't be late this time. Don't forget. All right. So we are here at the 9/11 Memorial, and we just caught our first ente. Uh, in the screen recording right before this, you'll see it. Now we're going for ente number two, and we're going to go in with 11 balls. And uh, hopefully we can get a better one, which is all we need now. But 1897 for our first ente, 1913. That's pretty high. That's very high. All right. So, lots of entes have ran away from us, so we don't have great ente luck. Yeah. All right. There we go. Not really a great throw, but very close. We got 17 people out here for this Ente, which was crazy. And uh, so far, we haven't really had much luck with Entes today, um, or at all. We are now one for nine, going into our 10th one. Wow. So, still other people looking for their first entes, and that's right, I missed. What is with my throws?
There we go. What? Okay. This is a very aggressive Entei. Very aggressive. Ah, I almost got me. Wow. Okay. There we go. Just past the grade, so not a great throw. One, and right out. Okay. Hey, someone got an Entei. There we go. All right, four balls left. Come on. Patience. Patience is key with all these dogs. Don't need a berry. There we go. Great throw. No. One. I was 0 for 8 before I got mine. Lucky number nine. That was mine. Alright. Oh, what is that? Alright, last ball. What is that? What are my throws? Alright. Where is Pokemon Go taking us right now? That's a good question. We're on our way to another Entei raid because this is all about Entei's today. So far we are 1 for 10. Technically 1 for 9 because we didn't beat one Entei the other day. But 1 for 10, 10% chance. We're looking to raise the percentages and hopefully catch Entei number 2. Alright, so we got Entei down, we got some rare candies, but well, one is some golden raspberries actually. No golden raspberries. Let's see, seven contribution by team. Three. Team Instinct taking the win. Very nice. Ten balls. And uh I've never been here before, but 1894. So pretty okay. Pretty okay. Hopefully we can actually curve it correctly this time. There we go. No. Okay. So there have been quite a few theories about what will the Halloween event be. Halloween event, uh, according to the post by Pokemon Go, or Pokemon.com. Oh, we got Entei. Sweet. <laughs> According to the post by Pokemon.com, it's ghostly goodies, which is probably going to be double candies, candies being goodies. Up, and then new Pokemon, filling the Pokedex. Again, probably not going to be Gen 3, but more probably Smeargle, maybe releasing in some different colors, black, orange, etc. for Halloween. Maybe some new shiny Pokemon or some costumes for the Halloween event. Suicune will be released during that time because of the monthly migration. So that will be released on the 31st, which is Halloween, so that will be a new Pokemon. Uh, they could tease some new Gen 3 babies, why not, and Azuril, like they did with all the baby Pokemon from Gen 2. But as far as like a mass release of Gen 3, probably not. But we will see everyone at the next Entei raid. There's a Weezing raid going on, but that's not very interesting. Nothing else nearby. See you for another Entei raid. Alright, so instead of more Entei, that was kind of it for that day. Uh, this is actually another day. Um, I'm gonna go out and do a little bit of grinding, but that's how I'm gonna be at the end, end of the episode. This is the end of the episode. Uh, if you did like the episode, go ahead and smash that thumbs up button. If you enjoyed the series, please subscribe. As always, God bless. See you for another episode of Pokemon Go. And be sure to watch uh, whatever your Play Store is, because a new and very exciting Hey, that's uh, the update. Cool. So I'm actually going to be updating my Pokemon Go right now to version 77.1. Uh, there's a lot of people that have already been uh, APK mining and all that good stuff. So very exciting news uh, pertaining to a lot of bug fixes. And we're getting closer to Gen 3, but still probably not the next big thing, in my opinion. See you for the next episode.